Hey everyone, awesome Disney Toys here, and we're making another gummy soda bottle. We've already done Sprite, orange soda, cola, and a few other drinks, but we haven't done Dr. Pepper yet. Let's see how this turns out. We've been doing a lot of the two liter bottles, so this soda bottle looks extra small today. But let's go ahead and pour this all out into the pot. Woo, that was quick. Next step, we're gonna need eight packets of unflavored gelatin. We'll pour them in by twos, two, four, six, and eight. Check out this pile of gelatin powder. All right, so grab something to stir with and we're gonna mix this until all the powder dissolves. Since this is a regular soda bottle, it shouldn't take too long like the two liters. Okay, now let's turn the stove on to low heat and step away for just a few minutes. While we wait for the liquid to heat up, let's quickly take off this label from the bottle. You may want to use an X-Acto knife or a pair of scissors to cleanly rip it off. Oh, quick warning, be sure to ask someone for help if you can't handle sharp objects. Don't want you getting hurt. And perfect. Here's our Dr. Pepper soda label. Set that aside to use later. Let's go back to the bottle. And I'll have to use the X-Acto knife again to cut a line right down the middle. And we don't want any liquid pouring out, so let's get a piece of duct tape and tape it right above the cut. Oh, just a heads up. You still might get a few small leaks. So if you want to place a napkin under the bottle, feel free to do so. Woo! Okay, going back to our pot. We had left it right after we turned the stove on to low heat. And it's been sitting like this for about 5 minutes. Make sure you give it a stir every once in a while. And we're going to have to keep heating it for another 5 minutes. So let's fast forward. Alright, so after 10 minutes, here's how your liquid should look. And you can go ahead and turn the stove off and let this cool for a bit. After it's cooled, you can pour the liquid back into the bottle, so I'll go ahead and do that. You know how Dr. Pepper has 23 flavors? I wonder if we'll be able to taste all the flavors in the gummy version. We'll have to wait and see. Okay, now let's seal the cap back on. And, ugh, the boring part. We're gonna have to leave this in the fridge overnight. See you tomorrow. And we're back. Our bottle is nice and cool. Let's rip the duct tape off. So far, so good. Grab a pair of scissors to cut the plastic. All right, bear with me while I rip this plastic off. It's not very entertaining, but someone's got to do it. Ooh, the bottle. I'm going to take a wild guess here and say it's going to feel like gummy. <laughs> I was right. But in all seriousness, seems like the bottle turned out just fine. But we won't really know until all the plastic is off. So let's keep tearing. Oh, yeah. Okay, fast forward. Whoosh. Now we just need to take the bottom and top part off. Let's start with the bottom part. And we have to be extremely careful. You don't want any part of the gummy bottle ripping off. Woo! Success! Check this out. This looks exactly like the bottom of a soda bottle. Alright. Now let's move on to the top portion. Be careful with this part too. And ta-da! Here is our perfect Dr. Pepper gummy soda bottle. Let's make this super real by wrapping the Dr. Pepper label we took off earlier around this gummy bottle. Wow! I can't believe it! This one is seriously an exact replica. Let's add the final touch, put the cap on top of the bottle, and I think we could fool anyone that this gummy Dr. Pepper bottle is in 
actual Dr. Pepper bottle. Hmm, let me try something. I think we can make it look more real if we have it stand on its own. Steady, steady. Oh, oh no, our cap. Okay, we'll get that later. Stay, stay. Oh, come on. Ah, it's not gonna work. Oh well, let's just go ahead and slice up this gummy soda bottle. Sit back, relax, and enjoy. I'll do a taste test in just a bit. Woo! That's a lot of slicing. Let's take a break and do a little taste test. Mmm! Definitely a hint of Dr. Pepper. Can't say I tasted all 23 flavors though. But just like with all the other gummy bottles, not as sweet as the actual soda. Still pretty good though. Well, this was a lot of fun. Thanks for watching. Please subscribe to watch more. See ya soon. Also, if you haven't done so already, be sure to follow me on Instagram, Facebook, and Twitter. The links are in the description box below.